Vinotech is definitely one of Darlinghurst's best kept secrets. We're told this is the place to come for a fantastic and extensive range of beers and wines and they also have an exquisite menu. Now Christian, some of my friends and no doubt a lot of our viewers are dying to hear about the beers that you have here, some of which we haven't really heard of in Australia. Yeah, that's true. Um, we are here at New German uh, European Wine and Beer House and um, our beers are from a private brewery near Munich called Maxel Reiner. The beers are brewed in the castle of a German prince called uh, Prince Erich von Lobkewitz. And uh, we select uh, all these beers in this uh, private brewery in near Munich and uh, bring it here to Australia. The beers are on a standard never seen before in Australia. That's fantastic. And what yeah. beers have you selected for us tonight? Can we have um, a taste? Sure. For tonight, uh, we select uh, Schloss Gold from Maxel Reiner. Mm -hmm. That's a lager in the classic style. And uh, we serve these beers in our stones, we so thought it's not a glass. Let me try that. Let me try it. And it's brought in the classic lager style. It's good. Yeah. Really like good. It. And also the girls like the smaller one beers in uh, 330 ml. So you've given me the men's beer to start with. <laughs> we might have to swap glasses there. Because uh, Zwickel Max. The difference to this uh, lager is uh, it goes unfiltered into the bottle. Yeah. It's a classic lager beer, but unfiltered to the bottle. It's beautiful. That's definitely my favorite. I'll let you have this one. <laughs> and cheers. Cheers. Some more. Now, can you take us over to the wine cabinet to take a look at the wines sure. now? Sure. Now, Christian, tell us about the different regions of wines that you've got here. We bring right now 66 uh, exclusive award winning um, German and Austrian wines right now to Australia. For example, here our Spätburgunder. It's one of our gold medal winning award wines from uh, Germany. All these wines uh, and uh, comes from um, German uh, grape regions uh, are owned by very old families, so they're all handcrafted as well. Now I believe you take great pride in recommending your wines with your food? Yes, uh, we want to recommend all our wines to match the food as well. With experience in three-star Michelin restaurants, let's talk to head chef Guillaume Trucat. Guillaume, tell us how your past experiences have actually influenced the menu here. So all my past experience in different restaurants where I'm working before just teach me how to make a nice mix with different products from different countries like Germany, France and here Australia. And the perfect example what we have actually is the first Sydney Rock Oysters fried with a nice liver with pate, uh, typically German pate from, uh, from Germany. And as you mentioned before, you take your time matching up the wines with the food. What have you got for us tonight? You've picked out a few? So tonight we've got the Rack of Flam and we make the nice Dorf Nelda 2003. It was a really excellent wine, it's going very well with the lamb and the rosemary usually was going with the lamb. Fantastic. After we've got the, the salmon, we serve with a fennel and a hazelnut salad. It's going very well with the Schwarz Riesling because the Schwarz Riesling makes the balance with the acidity of the, um, of the uh, fennel. Beautiful. And for finish, we have a nice dessert wine, very sweet wine. It's going very well with the red berry mousse and lemon foam when I mix it together. And when you drink with those really sweet wine, let's make a perfect kiddie as well, perfect balances with the dishes and the drinks. Fantastic, great recommendations, thank you. Thank you very much.